We all know how difficult it is to create realistic skin in Blender. But what if I told you there is an add-on out there that can add photorealistic skin to your characters in a short period of time? But you might say you are exaggerating, because creating realistic skin is a complex process that takes a lot of time. However, with this add-on called Humanify, the process is as easy as just picking the skin type and voila. Hey guys, I hope you are doing well and welcome to today's video. Humanify, or as it is called, one-click skin shader, can be a powerful add-on for creating realistic skin. The add-on offers a library of premium hyper-realistic skin presets that are procedurally adjustable. The shaders or materials themselves are based on high-resolution textures that can go up to 8K, so close-up shots won't be an issue, and you can just take a look at some of the examples that were created using the add-on. Talking about high resolution, the add-on actually is very optimized and doesn't require a ton of performance compared to what you usually need. You are rendering a skin shader with subsurface scattering here, so we will need a GPU, but that's true in general. It is very important to note that the add-on is built on DAS3D Genesis, so if you use any character from this collection, you are not going to have to do that extra work by unwrapping the mesh because all the characters are unwrapped and ready to be used. Actually, for DAS 3D users, you can just use the DAS to Blender bridge to import your characters straight to Blender, but you can also export them as FBX or OBJ. The add-on can be perfect for beginners as well as for advanced users due to its simple and accessible interface. However, if you want to go deeper into nodes, you can adjust every minor detail about the shader that can include even adding more material properties. The skin presets in the add-on are divided into four categories, targeting each body part, which are the head, body, arm, and the legs. Even better, each preset has a thumbnail preview, so you know exactly what type of preset that you are dealing with before applying it. To apply a preset, select your character, select the texture that you like from the add-on, and hit apply. And it is as simple as that. And at the moment, there are only 5 skin presets for each body bar, but the developer is promising more presets every month, which are gonna be added to the library hopefully. I mean, how hard can it be to adjust skin? Well, in fact, it is hard. The add-on offers a very easy method for adjusting the materials from the shader node editor. Due to it being procedural, you can actually adjust any value and freely customize the skin properties. For example, things like skin roughness, specular reflections, subsurface scatter radius, skin color saturation, and the amount of high details. Now, if you choose to use your own 3D models, you will have to unwrap and align the UV map to textures first. Proportional editing is a great way to align the UV very quickly, and the add-on can also be used for personal as well as commercial projects. So generally speaking, this add-on can be really useful with its high quality and physically accurate presets that can be used for example for some decent VFX projects. So guys, if you are interested in this add-on, you will find all the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to this channel to receive more videos like this. Thank you guys very much for watching again, and I will see you in the next one.